Hello and welcome to this guide on setting up MetaMask on your Chrome browser and connecting to the Polygon mainnet. First of all, install MetaMask by going to metamask.io and clicking on the download for Chrome button. You will be redirected to the Chrome web store. Here, click add to Chrome. Now, let's create a new wallet and agree to the terms and conditions. It's time to create a strong password for your wallet. Please make sure to save your password in a trusted place so you don't accidentally lose it. Now, please select Secure My Wallet. Please make sure to take extra precaution in this next step. Your recovery phrase is the key to your wallet. Please make sure to note down your recovery phrase. The importance of this step cannot be overstated. Fill out the recovery phrase as it was shown. Again, Please make sure to keep your security phrase in a safe space. After finishing, feel free to pin your wallet to your Chrome homepage. Now, on the top of your screen, you will see Ethereum mainnet. Click on it, go to Add Network, scroll down, click on the Add button next to the Polygon mainnet, and then approve the change. Now, please take a moment to copy your wallet address and send it to us. Similar to providing your home address for a package delivery, we require your wallet address to send you your NFT from either the friend NFT collection or the trust walk NFT collection. Now, in the forms link shared with you, please enter your email address, your MetaMask wallet address, which was the address you copied in the previous step and then please enter it again to confirm your wallet address you can now pick any frame that you want and based on it you will be receiving your nft please understand by submitting this form you are directing us to send the nft to the provided wallet address please double check for accuracy we genuinely care about ensuring that you receive your nft seamlessly remember an incorrect address might lead to an unrecoverable loss and we wouldn't want for that to happen. Sumeru Digital cannot be held accountable for the inaccuracy in the information provided. Congratulations! You have successfully completed this guide.